my god. Are we rolling? Five, yeah. four, three, two, one. All you white people, <laughs> Caucasians and non-Caucasians, it's time for a ghetto story. Yay! Yay! All right, all right, all right. Just got nails done at the at the corner of the nail salon and Violet <laughs> Nemes restaurant. What's My name is Ghetto the Clown. No, the I'm the pain for it, dummy. All right. <laughs> Shampoo Quisha just got her nails done at the corner at the corner nail salon <laughs> at the Violet Restaurant. She just got a new a new sitting on the couch. Yee wee! Good lord, my nails look good, even though I spent. Two hundred dollars of the rent money. They look good at good a putter. Right then, goody patootie. Goody patootie. <laughs> <laughs> right then, Sham Shampoo Quisha heard a loud knock on the door. Who be that? <laughs> she opened the door, and it was a Mr. Whitey. I hate Mr. Whitey. <laughs> now that's racist. All right. It was Mr. Whitey, that mean ass landlord. Well, hello, darling. I'm here to pick up the rent. It's not due until next week. Shampoo said, Mr. Whitey just smiled and said, I won't be around next week because I, I'm going to Palm Springs and relax. Yay! Read that part! Someone. That part. <laughs> Ch children's Palm Springs is where all the rich hookers do. Rich hookers be shump. Honkies. Honkies. <laughs> you know, you got a lot of spell, man. This stuff is freaking day, dude. Anyway. I like hookers. Shampoo started to cry and said, oh, please, Mr. Whitey, I don't have all the money today. I can't. Can I please have a little more time, sir? Mr. Whitey said, shut up, bitch. Give me all my rent money, or you know how you're going to pay the rest of it off. Oh, no. Not that, Mr. Whitey. Gee, we me some sugar, baby. Mr. Whitey. Mr. Whitey said with a smile. Oh, that, Mr. Whitey. What a sleazy old... Cracker, well, children's, the moral of the story is don't answer, don't answer the door after getting your nails done. Yeah! Yeah!